Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for around the third, maybe the fourth. The timing is fluid. These can be up to a week, a week out, whatever. You know, it could be today, it could be tomorrow, whatever. We're just gonna see what comes up. If you're questioning the bruise on my hand, I don't know if you can really see it. You might be. Able, yeah, I guess you probably can. I had to. They tried to put an IV in, and it hurts. Anyway, it didn't, uh, didn't work out. I got a worse one that did work out. But anyhow, um, it's nothing big. Don't worry about it. I don't know why I guys told you that. But anyway, um, so yeah. So what do we got for an upcoming energy? What do we have for an upcoming message? Nothing bad. It was nothing bad, so don't worry about it. Anyhow, um, what do we have for an upcoming message? The fool. We may have somebody here that is acting like a fool, but this could also be a new beginning, and then this is a this is a new journey to uh, starting a new chapter. Um, a new phase is about to begin. Okay, um, it looks like it's this is exciting. This is exciting. It's like ready. Ready? Are you ready? Are you ready for this new beginning? Because here it is. So, it's you're being called to step forward with blind faith. This is have no fear. Um, looks like we do have somebody here that is ready. They are ready to step forward. They're ready to start their new life. We have a new beginning. First card, fantastic. Starting from scratch. Okay, we're going to start over. We're going to start right now. Starting right now. Three of Pentacles reversed. So the Three of Pentacles reversed is there's lack of teamwork, lack of togetherness. There could be a third party situation. Somebody's deciding to go their own way. I don't want to be involved in this. You know, this is free spirit. I'd rather go by myself. I don't need this baggage. I don't, you know. So we may have somebody here that is going in a new direction. You know, they're not going to work with a three, these three. Okay, they're not going to work. They're not going to work with these people. Not going to work with you. Because that is what the three of pentacles is. Lack of teamwork. There could be a lack of respect. There could be uh, some people that are not on the same page, right? There's lack of harmony with others with the three of pentacles reversed. So somebody is deciding to go their own way. Okay, I'm just going to... and then, But then again, somebody may have been foolish, so interesting. An obstacle is being removed with the Eight of Swords reversed. Somebody, remember we had this the other day. Somebody, there's some sort of lies. Somebody has been lying or they've been stuck in their head or they've been stuck in a situation. They may have been tied to a situation or they weren't seeing something. But now they are. Now if there's some sort of clarity. So it's coming out of a stagnation per se. It's coming out of mental conflict. This is an exciting opportunity to start over. Breaking free from, from somebody that they don't work well with or they don't get along with. There's just some sort of, maybe there's some sort of animosity, some sort of conflict here. But this obstacle is now being removed. Judgment. Judge, somebody is making a judgment call because they're seeing the truth. The truth is being revealed, okay? And this is the end of something that was very conflicting. Somebody was stuck in a conflicting situation. This is also a wake-up call. So somebody may be getting a wake-up call. King of Swords, uh... Some, this person has been doing some sort of investigation. Looks like he has been studying. He has been getting ready. He's been doing his homework. He's been studying. We have a professional here that has been taking notes. Wise man. This is a wise man. Hmm. 
You've been taking notes, even if it's mental notes, because this is mental. But this in reverse, it's, it's good. So, hmm, obstacles. So he's making a decision. Ooh, nine of swords reversed. Somebody's fed up. Somebody is exhausted and fed up. Fed up. Can't do it anymore. This is too much. It really is. You could be feeling extremely uh, sad. Depressed. Worried. This is extremely. We have somebody here who just can't take it anymore. I can't do this anymore. So, yeah. This, mm -hmm. Ten of Cups reversed. We have a relationship, seriously, that is not on the same page. And relationship could be with anybody. But this is like in something not happening. A relationship not being successful. This could be a dying dream, a relationship problems. So there is some sort of relationship problems here. We have somebody that is extremely overwhelmed. The lovers reverse. We have a contract that is coming to an end. This is a this is a and this could be even like a lover's quarrel or something, you know, where it, it causes an ending. Because this is an ending. So it's like this is the end end of a relationship, of a contract. We have somebody here that hasn't been able to sleep. They're it's they've been having headaches, they've been having migraines, they've have been very stressed out. And maybe they've been uh, watching and suspecting a third party or worried about a third party or something like that. Anyhow, we have somebody here that is very, very stressed out about, you know, a love connection. It's like there's no um, compatibility here with the lovers reverse. There's a conflict. There is definitely a disharmony in a relationship. There's disharmony. Okay, disharmony here, disharmony here, disharmony here. So there's some disharmony in a relationship. And there's probably going to be a separation. i got to be honest with you. Somebody is deciding to go their own way. And I think it's because there's a third party. It's like we can't... Yeah, three is absolutely a crowd. And this is my second reading. And I might just let the first one go through now that this one has... It's pretty much the same message. So, um, this is making a judgment call, seeing the truth, opening your eyes. Somebody is, is maybe getting a wake up call or they're seeing the truth on a situation. Um, now something about a reconciliation, perhaps maybe there's a reckon. Somebody may want another chance, but maybe they haven't been telling the truth. They've been keeping it to themselves. Four of Pentacles reverse. Things are about to open up. Things are about to change. There may be a fallout. I think there is going to be a fallout of some some sort. There's going to be a fallout. Somebody's going to probably have a conflict. Um, now this King of Swords. This guy is very intelligent, very wise. He he sees something. He knows something. <whistles> Tower. Boom. Shake up. Light is about to be shed on a situation. There is going to be... Oh, my God. That's what it's going to be. An oh, my God moment. It's going to be like, Wow. It is going to be a wow moment. There's going to, I think there's going to be a breakup. I think there's going to be a breakup and I think it's going to happen suddenly. It's like a sudden disruption that causes uh, an awakening. And I think it's a rude one. I think it's a rude awakening. Somebody is going to lose something that they could have saved, but they didn't save it because, you know, that's like a little bank account. It's like now they're, they didn't remember. We, I've talked about this before about taking it to the bank. It's like now, you know, something, this is a loss, a loss of stability. Somebody, and this is losing stability as well. False foundation, a false contract. So we have a false contract here. False relationship. Okay. So yeah, we have a false relationship here and things there's going to be a, a sudden change in that relationship. There's going to be a disruption. Which, and you know, when the tower falls, it's a necessary evil that forces you to start with a clean slate. So we do have a clean slate. We have a new beginning here. 
So something is about to crumble, and I think it's going to crumble really, really fast. I do. It does have to do with a relationship, and it's a love partnership of some sort. It's a love relationship that you know, has causing somebody a lot of stress. It is. Because there's a third party, three is absolutely, positively a crowd. So, we have somebody here that is deciding to go their own way. One second. I'm just going to let that go. So, this is an, an, a disruption of some sort. There could be a shock. Okay, this is a rude awakening. This is a rude awakening. This is an awakening. This is a shock of some sort. A shocking disruption that, you know, causes a breakup or a split. Okay? So there's going to be a split of some sort. Oh! Something to do with this high priestess. So we got the high priestess here. She knows what's going on. Right? She does. Okay, she's got the answers right here in her hand. So it looks like we got a high priestess here who has the cards in her hand. She's holding the cards. She has the answer. She knows exactly what is going on. Looks like she has a lot of power. She's smiling. She has the power in her hands. Um, she has a connection. She has a connection to higher power. She's predicting this loss. Mm -hmm. She is predicting this uh, disruption. She knows that this contract is not meant to be. She knows. She's smiling though. She must know something else. Look at me. <laughs> what else does she know? What else does she know? She's very receptive. She is. Magician. Magician. She's magic. She knows. She knows that she has the power now. Or somebody has the power. What the hell is going on here? Is it that important? I'm not going to answer it again. Oh, son of a bitch. This is the power. Something is really important, obviously. Because my phone is like ringing off the hook. And this is a call. Somebody may be getting a call that is very important, to put it that way. So this is a card of action. Somebody taking action to bring success. Willing to do whatever it takes. This is somebody who is very skilled and masterful. This person has the power has the resources to change things. So this is somebody that is very powerful. Has a divine, we have a divine, we have somebody here that is magical that has a divine connection because this is a divine connection. This person really does know Now, this, this, I'm not sure if we have a Gemini here. There's a Gemini here and a Gemini here. It doesn't have to be a Gemini, but, and this is a Gemini, so I'm not sure if we're dealing with a Gemini, but this is somebody that is making a decision. They are making a decision, and I think this decision is going to cause an uproar. This person, it's going to cause an uproar. So I do think there's going to be some sort of uproar here. We have, this person is very focused. We have somebody here that is very focused on change or something like that. So I feel like we have somebody here that is about to get some sort of wake-up call that may even cause some sort of... They may get, the, may get a call. They may get a call from somebody. 
And it may be this, maybe a family member, because it's a family member. It may be a lover, okay? I don't know. Somebody, they may get a call or a message from somebody that um, makes them feel broken, because this is broken, broken inside, because this is broken. This is a broken relationship. I, we have a separation here. We have a, and I think it's a masculine, and I don't care what any of you guys say. I feel like we have a masculine that is taking action, and it may be a feminine. It could be a feminine. Uh, we have somebody here that is taking action to go in another direction. Okay, this person is, is leaving the baggage behind. They are. We have a brand new beginning here. This person is making, they've done their homework. They've done their investigation. They've been making the plans for a while. They've been making plans. Now, I hope this isn't, I just, I hope this isn't like a bomb going off. Because, you know what I mean? I'm just, I'm just being honest. Okay. Whatever. It is what it is. It could be a bomb going off. This person, it looks like he's, you know, writing things down, making plans right in the tower. So I'm not sure if there's a bomb that is about to go off. And, yeah, I'm not sure what is going on here. There is a bomb that is about to go off, okay, in somebody's life. It's going to be a, it's the bomb that drops, okay, which causes somebody uh, or moves somebody in a new direction, okay? So be prepared for that. Um, be prepared to hear the truth, okay, because this is the truth. Be prepared for a wake-up call. Something that you are holding on to is slipping away. It's not stable. You have the resources and the power within you to be successful and overcome whatever this is. It, it looks as though there's going to be some sort of major disruption. It's like the bomb drops and... Uh, somebody takes action. Um, I think there's a breakup. There's a split. I do. And there's somebody here that is very seductive. The high priestess is very seductive. She is. They may be taking action towards this high priestess. This is somebody that is uh, very masculine, very cunning, very clever, very smart, very intelligent. So, hmm... I think that we should all be prepared, if this reading is for you, for some, some sort of major change that is going to... It's a shock. It is definitely a shock. It's been planned. It's, it's been planned. It wasn't something that wasn't planned. It has been planned. This person has been planning to drop this bomb, and here it comes. So good luck.